Hey, eighth grade. So today we're going to be working on geothermal energy. And we're going to write what geothermal energy is. And then we're going to also do the pros and cons. So I want to set up my slide ahead of time for that. And um, I'm going to set it up with the pros and cons. And I'll even add a text box so that I can put my definition up here. And I'll make these just a little bit shorter so that I can have a picture. And um, um, so I'll start with my definition. Geothermal energy is dot, dot, dot. And I'll go ahead and just use my parentheses right now so I can get ready to save my evidence. And when I went to my search engine, I just typed in, what is geothermal energy? And I got this government website that explains it. Um, geothermal energy is heat within the earth. It comes from the Greek words geo and therme, which means heat. Um, okay, this is what I, this is what I want to do. So geothermal energy is a renewable energy source because heat is continually produced inside the earth. People use geothermal energy for bathing, to heat buildings, and to generate electricity. Perfect. I'm going to copy that down. I'm going to go ahead and use quotation marks. And I already have the words geothermal energy is. So I'm going to delete this part and put three continuation dots instead. And let me move my picture down here. And I'll move my text box a little bit bigger. And then now I can start working on some pros. So let me move my text boxes so that I have a little bit more room and some pros. And I'll go ahead and put my parentheses there as well. Um, I need to go to a different website for my pros and cons. So let me just cite this very quickly in my works cited section. So the new number, and I can do that for number 10. This is my 10th website. So that means that this website is going to be number 11 because it's a different website. And I'm just going to pick a few pros. So I typed into my search engine pros and cons of geothermal energy. And I found this one, energyinformative.org. Um, it's considered environmentally friendly and does not cause significant amounts of pollution. That's a definite pro, especially with all this stuff about global warming happening right now. So I can paste that in there and use my quotation marks. And then let me find a couple more. Um, they are naturally replenished and therefore renewable. It's not possible to exhaust the resources. That's great. So we can always use it. So add some more quotation marks and copy and paste it in. And then let me try to get one more. Um, great for heating and cooling. Small households can benefit. Great. So those are some great pros. Put some quotation marks, copy and paste, and add that in there. Now let's take a look at some cons. And I can find cons in the same place. So I'm going to keep citing website number 11. So on the same page, if I scroll down a little bit, it has some cons for using. Um, so there are minor environmental issues concerning geothermal power. It's important to recognize. And I'll add my quotation marks here. And add quotation marks for my next one. It can cause earthquakes. That is a big deal. Okay. And I only have a few seconds left. So I'm going to cite my evidence on my works cited slide, and I'm going to add a picture that talks about geothermal energy. I'll show my slide in Google Classroom so you can see my finished product, and hopefully that will help. 